Johnson is here in the United no States. Plastic prison for the rest of his life. Wailing in court today from relatives of a man who was ambushed and shot more than a dozen times inside an Oak Park barber shop. 10 News reporter Steve Fiorina is live. And, and Steve, it was so emotional that some relatives had to be escorted out today. That's how it went down this afternoon. We saw incredible motion here, Kim, four months ago outside the barber shop as this uh, took place. And time has not healed the scars. Emotions still very raw as the man accused as being the trigger man was arraigned. The prosecutor told of Lamar Kennedy being ambushed in his Oak Park barbershop. Details that sparked wailing among the victim's relatives. There were 14 casings uh, found uh, around the body of Mr. Kennedy. Uh, most of the missiles hit Mr. Kennedy directly targeting the head area. Um, Mr. Johnson. <laughs> Deputies urged one overwrought woman from the courtroom as the hearing continued. Bail was set at $10 million for a man labeled very dangerous, his face electronically blurred on judges' orders. Although there is this mugshot, the victim's aunt screamed that Peter Johnson should rot in prison for the rest of his life. Outside the courtroom, Kennedy's mother broke down in tears as she relived the murder last spring, a day with grieving family members out of control as police tried to maintain the crime scene. I wish he didn't have no bail because, you know, he killed my son and shot him 14 times. <laughs> but we thank you guys. We, we thank, thank the police you guys for everything. I'm angry. I'm mad. And this was intentional. This was an intentional killing on someone that was loved, that was a father, that was everything to us. The DA said Johnson was once deported to Jamaica as part of an alleged international drug trafficking operation. Now, he faces 50 years to life in prison if convicted. A co-defendant was arraigned last month. Live in Oak Park, Steve Fury, 10 News.